Give him glory. Give him glory. God's gonna get it. God's gonna get the glory out of this. Come on, sing it to him. So just give him glory. Give him glory. Give him glory. Give him glory. God's gonna get it. God's gonna get the glory out of this. Come on, somebody, sing it to him. Just give him glory. Give him glory. Give him glory. Give him glory. God's going to get it. God's going to get the glory out of this. Come on and sing it to him. So just give him glory. Give him glory. Give him glory. Give him glory. God's going to get it. God's going to get the glory out of this. You know, somebody listening to me this morning, you just need to lift your hands to heaven and say, Lord, I surrender. I give this trouble to you. I've been trying to fight with this thing. I've been trying to fix it in my own strength, but I surrender this morning. You know, the Bible says, casting all your cares on him for he cares for you. Say, Lord, I give it to you this morning. Come on, somebody. Say, I give it to you this morning. I give it to you. I surrender this burden. Jesus said, come unto me, all you that are labor and heavy laden. He said, take my yoke upon you and learn of me, for I am meek and lowly in heart, and you shall find rest unto your souls, for my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Just lift your hands to heaven in total surrender. Give him glory. Give him glory. Give him glory. God's going to get it. God's going to get the glory out of this. Come on and sing it with me. So just give him glory. Give him glory. Give him glory. Give him glory. God's going to get it. God's going to get the glory. Somebody getting a breakthrough this morning. Somebody getting a breakthrough this morning. Come on and lift your heads to heaven. Give him praise. Give him glory. Give him glory. God's going to get it. God's going to get glory out of this. God's going to get the glory. And God's going to get the glory out of this. The devil going to be proved to be a liar. Because God's going to get the glory out of this. I know the devil means it for your heart. But guess what, church? God's going to get the glory out of this. God's going to get it. God's going to get it. God's going to get the glory out of this. God's going to get it. God's going to get the glory out of this mighty God. Glory to Jesus. Glory to Jesus. Eba Shaya Musa. Bless you this morning, God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. He's a mighty God. It's here, the book we've been waiting for, Seven Ways the Holy Spirit Speaks to Us, a complete guide to hearing God. Pastor Sean Pinner gives readers life-changing keys on exploring, understanding, and experiencing the voice of God, which every believer can hear on a daily basis. Packed with powerful revelations, this book shares the methods, means, and motivations for the voice of God, and provide answers to questions like, how to hear God, recognize His voice, tap into His guidance, and much more. 
Receive confidence on hearing God through the Word, dreams and visions, divine impressions, and more. And discover a much deeper and more intimate walk with the Lord. Order Seven Ways the Holy Spirit Speaks Today, available on Amazon and all major book suppliers. Your journey into the powerful realms of God's voice starts here. Oh, bless His holy name. So on this morning I'm talking about it's shifting in your favor. My God, it's shifting in your favor. Praise God. So we in Psalms chapter 126 verses 1 through 6, David said, when the Lord turned again the captivity of Zion, we were like them that dream. God turned a terrible situation around for his people. We had one of our partners wrote into the ministry and she said, Pastor Sean, I'd ask you to pray with me in 2018 because one of the board members of the apartment complex that I live at wanted to sue me and God turned it around and gave me the victory but that one fight wasn't enough for her so she took me to court again and tried to sue me again and I called for prayer again and God answered all of our prayer and he turned it around and I won the court case come on somebody let's give God a praise oh my God that testimony so blessed me so just give him give him glory and give him glory come on give him glory give him glory God's gonna get it God's gonna get the glory out of this. Come on and sing it to him. So just give him glory. Give him glory. Give him glory. Give him glory. Him glory. God's gonna get it. God's gonna get the glory out of this. God's gonna get the glory. Sing it to him. God's gonna get the glory out of this. <laughs> oh, come on, bless him, bless him, bless him. Come on, bless him this morning. Mighty God, mighty God, mighty God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Oh, we love you. <laughs> bless him, the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I feel the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Come on and bless him. Hallelujah. Oh, he's a mighty God. He's a mighty God. <laughs> he's a mighty. Glory to Jesus. Hallelujah. My God, my God, my God. Show the word of the Lord. In Psalms 126, when the Lord turned again the captivity of Zion, we were like them that dream. My God, our partner was like them that dream. Ronald Miller, another partner, debt of between six to eight thousand dollars, canceled by the power of God. Verse two, then was our mouth filled with laughter on our tongue with singing that's why i can't help but to sing i tell you god gave us a breakthrough uh in 2019 my god i'm still singing about it glory to god then said they among the heathen these are the unbelievers even the unbelievers will take note at the breakthrough that god will bring into your life then said they among the heathen the lord has done great things for them. Remember when Joshua sent the two spies into Jericho, they met a woman by the name of Rahab. And Rahab said to the two spies, 
we have heard how God defeated Pharaoh and other kings, how God opened up the Red Sea for Moses, and because of what your God have done, our hearts have melted because of you. Even the heathen, the unbelievers, will have to acknowledge what God is doing in your life. Verse 3, the Lord has done great things for us, whereof we are glad. Turn again our captivity, O Lord, as the streams in the south. I love verse 5 and 6. They that sow in tears shall reap in joy. You've been crying. You've been fasting. You've been praying. You've been seeking God. And the Bible says in verse 5, they that sow in tears, because there is that time to sow. There is that time to put the time in and cry out to him and fast and seek his face over that situation. But the Bible says, they that sow in tears shall reap in joy. Psalm chapter 30, verse 5, weeping may endure for a night but joy comes in the morning. The Bible says this about Jesus, who for the joy that was set before him, he endured the cross, the suffering and the shame, even though he despised it, he was able to hang in there because his eyes was on the prize. He knew that joy was coming in three days when God would raise him from the dead and exalt him and give it give him a name that's above every name that at the name of Jesus every knee shall bow and every tongue must confess I stop by to tell somebody my God my God it's shifting in your favor it is shifting glory to God they that sow in tears shall reap in joy watch this he that goes forth and weepeth bearing precious seed shall doubtless come again with rejoicing bringing his sheaves with him there's a time to sow there's a time to sow prayers there's a time to sow fasting there's a time to sow so 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 I'm not talking about money. I'm just talking about spiritual things. Because if you sow to the spirit man, you will of the spirit reap eternal life. Glory to God. And of course, tithes and offering and those other things as well. But there comes a time when the harvest comes in. When, when the salvation of your entire family, your family is saved. They are delivered. They are set free by the power of God. You've been praying and believing God for that miracle. You've been believing God to be healed of cancer. And the moment comes... When the power of God sweeps through your body and in a few minutes the cancer is gone. The cancer is dead in your body. That sickness is dead. Come on somebody just give him a wave offering. Hallelujah. Mighty God, mighty God. I feel that anointing. I surrender all. Someone under the sound of my voice is ready to surrender their life to the Lord Jesus. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believes in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. You've been watching this broadcast and that moment is at hand. You are ready to surrender. God is ready for you to surrender. And without any further delay, I want you to pray this prayer after me. Say, Lord Jesus, I am a sinner in need of a Savior. I believe in my heart that you are the Son of God. You died on Calvary Cross for me. You were crucified. They buried you in a borrowed tomb. But on the third day, God raised you from the dead. Lord Jesus, wash me in your blood. Forgive me of all of my sins and write my name in the Lamb's book of life. Lord Jesus, I want to thank you this morning because you heard my cry. You have forgiven me of my sins and have written my name in the Lamb's book of life. Thank you, Jesus, for saving my soul. Listen. If you prayed that prayer and meant it with all of your heart, let me and Pastor Amy be the first to say to you, welcome 
into the kingdom of God. Welcome into God's family. I want you to type below this video right now. I've just surrendered my life to Jesus. Surrender. Oh, come on, sing it with me. Oh, I surrender all, all to thee. All to thee, my blessed Savior, I surrender all. I surrender all. Oh, I surrender all. Oh, I surrender all. All to Thee, my blessed Savior, I surrender all. Listen, we want to give you an opportunity to support the work of God, to support the preaching of the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ. To do so, you can visit us online right now, seanpinder.net forward slash give, seanpinder.net forward slash give. You can also give through the ministry PayPal account. That address is paypal.me forward slash seanpinderministries, paypal.me forward slash Sean Pinder Ministries. You can also give through the ministry Zell account. Our Zell email address is info at seanpinder.net. Info at seanpinder.net. And for tax purposes, email us your name and mailing address. You can also give through the ministry cash app account. That address is the dollar sign Sean Pinder Ministries. The dollar sign Sean Pinder Ministries and for tax purposes email us your name and mailing address if it's your first time giving. You can also mail your donations into the ministry. Just remember to make your checks and money orders out to Sean Pinder Ministries PO Box 2726 McKinney Texas 75070 and make sure let us know what's happening in your life through the word of the Lord that we are preaching. We read many of your letters. We receive many of your cards. It means a lot to us when people say thank you. It means a lot. We love hearing from you, our precious viewing audience. Continue to write into us by email and by mail. We love hearing from you. Your testimonies, the things you say in your letters, it moves us, it encourages us, and it helps God to work in our lives to show us how we can better minister to you never forget pastor sean and pastor amy we love you very much we care deeply about you we love you so much and remember subscribe to this channel click on that subscribe button and make sure I click on the gray bell turn on your notifications and remember check these videos out it will be a blessing in your life love you god bless you see you on tomorrow bye bye